Hey Facebook and YouTube fans, today we're talking Exceed Internet. We have a special guest, Brian. He came all the way from outer space to be with us today. So, let's get to it. Hey, Brandon, Drew, and Brian from Dean Satellite and Security. Brian is our special guest today. He is all the way from outer space, and he is with Exceed Internet. So we're gonna talk about some Exceed Internet today. So, yeah, the Exceed Internet is a great product. Um, it's a high speed internet now available in this area for the rural communities, primarily the rural communities right now. Um, you, it delivers a 12 meg speed, which what does that mean? Most of the DSLs in that area are getting 1.5 to 3 to maybe 10. Um, so it's speeds higher than um, your typical DSL. Um, and it's available wherever, as long as it's the second satellite, so as long as we're putting, you have, you have access to the sky you have access to exceed internet and high speed internet. And Brandon, in today's world, what is there that you do that is not on the internet? <laughs> not much. Not much at all anymore. And so high speed internet, you know, whether you want to, you know, whether you have kids in school, you know, I've heard, you know, kindergarten, mm -hmm. they're just taking iPads home to do the homework. Um, so you, you know, pretty much everything that you need now, you need the internet um, and it's a great backup you using your cellular data as well, so that way you're not chewing through your cell data mm -hmm. um, plan anymore. So again, it's available in in you know this area today um, for the high for the rural areas to deliver high speed internet. Um, so like what? So like how do people measure their data throughout what, like the month? Right. So it's you know it really depends on how much data you use or how the pro or how the programs are de developed or designed. Um, so the more data you use, you're going to want a bigger plan. It's not you're paying more for faster speeds. Everybody gets the same speed. Um, you know, if you're streaming Netflix, if you're streaming things like that, definitely give us a call. Um, we're going to find out how much you're using. Um, there's things that you can do from turning the HD full 1080. You can decrease that quality. Um, same thing on YouTube and Facebook. Um, you know, so as long as you're not doing a, as long as your internet isn't your primary source for video, um, if you, that's all you do, all you do is Netflix and, and game and Hulu and things like that, um, it's not going to, Exceed's not going to be the product for you, but that's why we work with several different companies. We work with Exceed, um, cable companies, um, DSL companies in the area as well, because that may be a better fit for what you and your family need, um, and that's why we, you know, that's why you come to us at Dean, just so that way we can... We can yep. give you all the options available. Yeah, and we'll put you guys in the best situation possible for you and your family. Uh, Brian, what do you think? Any, any input? He's pretty shy. Nothing. <laughs> That's two shy. videos that I've seen him in, and <laughs> not a word. Yeah, he just sits and while, smiles. Since he's been in the vlog. Yeah, so I mean, you know, we're here today just really talking about um, the internet options. Um, I've had a couple shows um, a few weeks ago, and. You know, a lot of people don't know, they think that they're stuck with the internet that they have in the rural areas. Um, so just know that there are other options for you out in the rural communities to deliver that high speed internet. Um, and it's, you know, you can stay local and deal with us right here at the satellite. So um, how does it work if you go over your data? So if you go over your data, it's not like your cell phone. Um, your cell phone, I, you know, I'm on a Verizon plan. As soon as I hit 100% 100 of my data, I know there's going to be a $15 <laughs> charge on my next bill or a $10, whatever it is. Um, Exceed, it's, once you hit your data um, in the Liberty plan, it just slows it down. Um, so it slows it down to up to one to five meg, which is typically what customers are getting anyways in the rural areas. Um, so you're gonna save, you know, you're gonna save the money where, you know, if you're on a hotspot or something like that and your kid uses, you know, 10 gigs of data and then another five, you know, you're probably looking at an additional 50 or $60 bill um, tacked onto what you're already. So there's no surprise charges, there's no overage fees, um, it just slows it down every 30 days. Well, what else besides internet we could talk about? Uh, sports, UFC. You know, yeah, UFC coming up. I saw um, tomorrow, uh, March Madness right around yep. the corner. That's that's uh, great enough soon. It's hard to believe we're in March already. Um, Daytona 500 was last weekend, so the NASCAR season is just getting kicked off. Um, you know, a lot of hubbub, a lot of hype around the new format. Um, new stage, format. Yes, yeah, so stage racing, so segment racing. So they took a normal race. Split it up into three segments. Um, there's kind of three different winners now. You got your overall winner, but then you have st segment winners um, with points on the line at 200 miles an hour and no downforce cars. It definitely took its toll. There was a lot of money spent last week in Daytona. Um, so tomorrow, or uh, two days, um, on Sunday, it's they're back at Atlanta. Um, you know, kind of a staple track on the season. 
Um, it's a shame I think they only have one race there now. It's a really fast racetrack. Um, so, you know, it's interesting to see how that is going. Um, you know, the Badger season, hopefully they can they get things turned around here. Um, and then baseball season. I was at a career fair yesterday watching uh, Brewers and Cardinals on spring training. Huh. Uh, so for you baseball fans, it's right around the corner as well. Awesome. Well, Okay. Yeah, I mean, there's, you know, it's okay. kind of, it's, you know, the weather's going up and down, you know, we're just kind of in a, a lull right now before, you know, the, the local short track racing season gets going, baseball comes back, and then you got football, and they got the uh, NBA playoffs, hockey playoffs coming yep. up, March Madness, can't wait, um, so right now we're getting, you know, we're just kind of on a holding well, We day. just got a huge, uh, Bracket. Yeah, we did. So if you checked out our Facebook page, we'll keep up on that. Um, that's something that comes to all commercial customers that, that subscribe to um, you know, our, our bars and restaurants package so that we can fill it out. So as soon as Selection Sunday comes, we'll fill that out and we'll do a, a little tournament dealio here. Maybe we'll put something on the line for, for whoever is the worst and maybe whoever is the best. <laughs> too. Maybe, the, maybe we'll have to have, do something silly on a uh, vlog video. Like stand up by the sign and say, I don't know how to pick. It's going to be you. It's going to be me. Yep. Predicting it now. Okay. We'll, we'll see. So, like this video, uh, comment. If you have any questions, we, we feel free to ask us. I would love to answer them. Um, we have but, we did have one comment on the video. They told us to oh, yeah. stop commenting on their videos. We're just trying to get viewers. That's yeah. right. I mean, we're just... A, couple guys looking to get some more views so maybe you can help us out and, and hit the share button share this video mm -hmm. um, let's get this spread out there really we become what is it called vlog famous yes that's our, that's our goal <laughs> right Ryan <laughs> well till next week <laughs> uh, enjoy the weekend stay safe see you guys next week